is your boy Blade Taylor, or my esports name is Slayer. Um, before we get through the day, uh, you know, we got to start off with breakfast, right? So uh, I, I have something a little bit controversial, or, or maybe just uh, you might think I'm psychopathic or something, but uh, you know, not too long ago, there was a big debate on the internet, right? And it was, uh, you know, whether you put in the cereal before the milk or the milk before the cereal, right? And that was like the big debate. Um, I think I do something a little crazier, and uh, I'm, I'm just gonna show you. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna gotta pour the cereal in first, right? But what comes next? You guys are gonna think I'm crazy. Sorry, I just had to turn the lights on, but bottled water. Bruh. I'll put too much in, but I throw it in there, right? And uh, voila, you've got cereal instead of milk, it's water. Mainly because of lactose intolerance, but yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit crazy. So, for today's schedule, I'm gonna take one of these scooters, head over to the, the campus, to the computer lab, so uh, I can get set up. Because I do coach a professional Rocket League team, I will be in there, uh, in their Discord call, and just like coaching them a little bit during the invitational qualifiers for fall. And uh, after that, I'm gonna jump into our warm up at 1 p.m. for our college match, and then 2 p.m. we'll be uh, playing against the University of Florida uh, for a qualifying match to get to the USF LAN. This is for Battle for Florida. It's a, it's a big event for Florida esports. And then after that, we're gonna get some schoolwork done and then go from there. guys I made it to the esports facility or the esports lab on campus and um, before I go into my coaching with my RLCS team I'm gonna show you guys our college bracket to show you kind of how we got to uh, the qualifying match today and just show you how we got there <clears throat> so here is our esports room right now we're Currently in the process of moving to another room, but here's the PC. We got the Alienware set up, but uh, basically right here, we uh, we were in a group. We got out of our group. That's the number one seed. We three out everyone. Uh, West Florida, Florida Poly, and Seminole. And then yesterday we uh, three two to FAU. Uh, it was closer than we wanted it to be. So uh, as long as we win this match right here against the University of Florida today on stream, we'll uh, make it to land, and uh, that's gonna be our. Uh, November 10th, so uh, I'm excited. No, I mean, just pretty much just have fun with this shit. I mean, just let the nerves out. I mean, I don't, I don't think it's too much stress, honestly, with this match, but uh, yeah. At the end of the day, today's just like a really good warm up test for next weekend, really. That's all it is. Just obviously, we're gonna qualify top eight, just use this to try to get good seating, but more importantly, just like just get the vibes going, everything like that, so that we're feeling confident going into next week. Yeah. Do not let up. Even if it's like a shit team or, you know, it's a close game, just keep going. Obviously, keep the good vibes up, but let's keep taking it to them. So, build confidence, build confidence, good comms, no double commits. So, I just wrapped up coaching uh, the RLCS team. They pretty much qualified, you know, making it into the main event. So, uh, it's, good. it's good for that. And then uh, now I can, like, really focus on warming up now. Um, but uh, right now, here's uh, Hayden, our disruptor. He's our sub slash hype man. He kind of started this whole thing with the school and bringing esports here. IRC, baby. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And then over here, we've got our boy, the legend, the myth, fucking Seabass, Sebastian. Yo, what's up? How you feeling today with our uh, series against UF? Honestly, it should be a walk in the park. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> <laughs> but like it, it really shouldn't be that hard. Just yes, pretty much sweep through and go to land. Yes, sir. Pretty yes, much sir. the whole thing. 
So we're feeling confident today. Um, just gonna, you know, get a warm up in today, and then we'll be on stream, and then uh, we'll take it from there. But yeah, we're feeling confident. Let's go. Still knocking on the door. Got some nice 50-50 from the US. We're gonna push things past Steve on the defense. Oh! Player pinches it in right over Jay Russ's head, bringing the series to a three. Or three zero, sorry, three two game for Iris. Oh, gets it down in the middle. Slayer gets it up. J Russ, not expecting it to be that clean of a hit. Just threaded the needle like Blitz pulling that victory out in game three. You're now on match Ooh. point for IRSC. The US has to reverse sweep here. Ooh, it's just and unfortunately, Unlucky. things are going to close out here. Flawless yeah. series for IRSC. Like I said, a huge change of pace from that war on I-4. IRSC, very, very dominant team. Go, 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 go. Alright, we just uh, went 4-0 against University of Florida, so uh, we qualified for the LAN, which is sick. So uh, it was a good feeling, and now we're here eating lunch at Chick-fil-A, so I'm about to dig it. Alright, so we just finished Chick-fil-A, very good, well needed, now we're back at the eSports facility, um, just gonna finish up some schoolwork, and then maybe watch some YouTube videos, play some Rocket League, and then uh, head back to the dorm and finish up, but uh, yeah. I just wrapped up my college algebra homework and uh, pretty much wraps up my day. So today was pretty eventful. Uh, we woke up, showed you that that crazy breakfast that I have. Um, came to the lab, warmed up. Well, I did some coaching first and I warmed up. Um, we did good, we qualified, so it's awesome. We're going to land, so I'm, I'm gonna be sure to record that in the future. Uh, it's gonna be one of the, the next day in the lives, but uh, I don't know, I would consider today a very successful day. We got some schoolwork done, we qualified for LAN, and uh, just a good day overall, good vibes. So just move from there, and uh, I'm very excited. But for today, that's pretty much it. I'm just gonna, you know, go back home uh, to the dorms, and uh, that's pretty much it. Just reset, go tomorrow, and uh, get ready for the LAN. I also wanna thank you all for watching this video. Be on the lookout because I do plan on making a ton of these um, just to give you an overall view of how college esports is a thing. And if you're one of those people that are interested in this, it is totally achievable. Not only can you make money from esports and playing video games, but you can also go to college, get a full ride if you're you're good enough, and uh, you know, you know, go into a career that you're interested in while pursuing esports and uh you know really create that backup plan for you if a uh, professional esports career doesn't work out and content creation doesn't work out you're able to get a degree you know so i, I really think esports is the future more and more schools are going to get into it so really really focus on keeping your grades up in high school keep those options open to as many many colleges as you can and uh at the end of the day like i said i, I think uh esports is the future so definitely Definitely stay tuned if you want to see more, just to see how it works. But uh, yeah, this has been it for me today. I just want to thank you guys for watching, and uh, see ya.